Okay, so stuff. Um, so we're building a temple there. We're not really I'm trying to save our money because we need to build a. Um, sorry, are we recruiting? Yeah, we're recruiting a regular druid. Sorry, furball druid. And we're going to use them to go build a laboratory down here in this forest. Hopefully that'll work. And I think we're okay. Okay, research-wise, what are we working on? Construction 2, so we can make some better magic items. Going to be a little while. 19 RP. That we need to only press, are doing 13 a month. We need more researching, basically. But we need more money first, which means we need more territory first. So, we're building the temple, then we'll move down here to this forest and probably take that one. 70 over there, but it's only 40 there, so we'll go after that one first. That's going to be the tough one. Militia, light cavalry, and heavy cavalry, which means we should be able to recruit cavalry from there, too. These guys. Deer tribe warriors and archers. Some archers, maybe. We'll see. Okay. Next turn. This is the druid. And going down. That way. So where's your stuff go? Cast a specific spell. Air shield to protect yourself. Flying shards. Hurl several stones toward the enemy units. The shards are not very powerful, but can severely injure lightly armored units. The number of shards hurled depends on the skill of the caster. 30 range. Personal sh flight and flying shield. What's flying shield? Range animates the shield to protect himself from incoming attacks. The shield will randomly block about half of the attacks against this person. Is that better than air shield? Air shield 80. Protective force 20. So you technically you'd want both. Personal flight. Do you need to fly? Maybe. Float a few inches above the ground. Floating units cannot be targeted by some spells uh, like earthquake or earthquakes. Uh, how about we'll just do cast spells? Still moving that way because I could build a laboratory over there. For reasons. I forget why. Oh, so we can recruit a shaman. That's why. Done here. Go beat up on those tribe warriors or 110. Oof. Okay, so. Temple is built. Forty-two. Researching, moving. Do nine, but we determined these were our best research options at thirteen, because I get other stuff too. And that's super expensive. Oh, you're cheaper. Why are you cheaper? Glamorous, that means you can do stuff. The Evil Core, welcome to the stream. Oh, Life Drain? But no, up close. I said, as a descendant of the Morgans, she is a seductress and blood drinker who haunts the wilderness. She takes the appearance of a stunningly beautiful maiden and lures humans to her deadly embrace. Uh, she's skilled in the use of glamour magic. Uh, take a great discomfort from iron and avoid it if they can. 
Oh, you're an assassin and everything. Very stealthy. Hmm. So what's the chance of her actually killing somebody, being an assassin? Can't assassinate enemy commander, commanders in the same province. The value in the case of possible patience bonus. If it is positive, there will be an increase in ch increased chance of other units, including bodyguards, not being present when the assassination occurs. A high patience bonus will also increase the chance of any possible guards going being asleep or surprised. Hmm. I think we're going to recruit you just for fun. to save our money a little bit so we can build a temple right away here. Don't have to wait, hopefully. Fingers crossed. Okay, next turn. There's a battle. So we lost... How did we lose a slinger? Somebody didn't run away fast enough, I think. Ronica needs more dogs. That's how we lost the slinger. No, we meant they're not shooting at the slingers. Those are the slingers. Though. I feel like I need to be wearing glasses with these guys. Patron of the Healing Spring. It's supposed to be Veronica of the Healing Spring. So, Slingers with 12 kills. Those guys. So, it's okay. Our missile artillery is very effective in killing enemies. Well, they're easy enemies to kill, that's why. Unexpected event in Windsong Forest. What's this one? Pirate ship has been discovered and the cargo is confiscated. Yay, gold, 750. So, there's some extra money we needed. So, you extract the lab. Gives us 900 here. Extract a temple. And Veronica, search magic sites and recruits. Get rid of that unrest by patrolling. Okay. So teeth. So this is a technically an assassin. Not necessarily a good one, but an assassin nonetheless. So can she make magic items? She can. Anything good? This would be Silent Boots, which is good for an assassin. Stealth Boost 20. Can't do any miscellaneous stuff, though. How come? Anyway, get you some Stealth Boots. Doing a lab. Building a temple, patrolling, searching, searching. I believe that is our turn. Hmm. 
No magic sites here. Boo. My bad afflictions was cured. So I didn't realize we had any battle afflictions anywhere. Wonder what it was. So I got rid of the troublemakers. Suddenly Lug the Long Hand Lug 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 the Long Handed has appeared in the gates of our uh, fortress. Wanted uh, to fight for our cause. He's a hero among the Tuatha. Uh, he is a grandson of Balor, High King of the Formorians, but his father and foster father are of the Tooth and Stock, Tuath and Stock. He appears to be as he appears as a young, handsome boy ablaze in solar glory. Glory. When he first arrived in the misty halls of the druid kings of Turnagnog, he was denied entrance if he did not show himself useful. Razor Elder was swordsmen, mages, harpists, poets, shipwrights, everybody. There was no place for Luke until he uh, asked if there were one who was able in all those arts. Arts. Uh, there was not, and Lug was accepted as a champion under the name of Lug of Many Skills. As champion of the Tuatha Kings, he uh, was dismayed by, at the acceptance of Fomorian oppression, led by his grandfather, Baylor. He now leads his people in war against the fell giants of Fomoria, armed with his enchanted spear. The spear is awakened and bursts into flames when battle is near. Such is the rage of the spear that only Lug can hold it back. Uh, the spear has uh, given Luke his name, Longhanded. Uh, long, lo Longhanded. Luke also wields the sling rainbow, which he always strikes the eye of the target. So, Luke. Gale yeah, Salt. So, I'm guessing that's the spear. That's a spear. Area effect, small area of fire. So, light people on fire. And rainbow the sling. <laughs> Effect on hit. I loss. <laughs> so. Uh, so look at him. He's everything. He looks OP? I don't know. He's got three fire, two air, two nature, three glamour, three priest, 25 research. He's, of course, sacred. He's got awe. Truly magnificent, no one would dare to strike his beauty and power. The chance of being affected by awe, the awe is determined by the attacker's morale. And you know, blah, blah, blah. At the minute hit point, 17 is actually decent for a human. Fire resistant. He's got glamour too, and fire shield. Surrounded by a powerful shield with flames, striking anyone that attacks. Most fire shields do not work underwater, you would think. For survival, siege bonus, sailing, supply bonus 20, so it can lead more troops. As dark vision, forge bonus, it's forge bonus. Very efficient at forging magic items. This bonus is a cost reduction in gems. And he's also a spell singer, so. Hmm. Sounds interesting. Now, the question is can we rename him? We can rename him if anybody wants to take on uh, his job. So what kind of stuff can he make? Nothing special yet, because our magic item choices are limited at the moment, so. Pendant of Courage, Summer Out plus five. Poison Ring, Tamed Lightning and Ring of Fire, so this is resistance. And that's resistance too. Okay. Look at his choices right now. Uh, blessing on himself, of course. Word of Thorns. Enters a prayer most holy and healing is struck by divine bolt. This prayer is imbued with nature and vines will rise from the ground and grab your target with its sharp 
thorns, causing severe bleeding in the process. Range of 30. Only one person, though. Do all kinds of stuff. Um, his air shield, but he didn't have the other one. Shroud of Splendor. Attackers are awestruck, and only have, only brave soldiers will attempt to strike the caster. Air shield to protect him from uh, what is it, uh, arrows and stuff. And the Shroud of Splendor to, uh, you know, only the stupid tried to hit you. Fire and keep distance. Um, we're most enemies. Take out their eyes. Usually leadership sits in the back, so... If he fires with his sling, he has a chance to take out their eyes. So hopefully that's a good thing, right? Okay, you forget to do this for you. If she gets into f f da -da -da. false fetters. Actually, don't even worry about that. Just retreat. She's going to be an assassin type, right? So she shouldn't be fighting. You, though. Control, defend, defend. So we have a temple here. Let's go pick up a few reinforcements and then go from there. Oh, look at this. Pegasus Riders and Amazons here. I haven't seen that before. And uh, research. Now, oh, what kind of ritual spell? Summoning of animals. Research. Patrol, patrol, research. You can. 60 enemy units, 60 there too. Let's see if she can kill somebody. See if that's an option when she gets over here to kill a commander. Oh, we need more research. Um, that's 9, 13. So, your turn. Draw research sneaking. Doing nothing. So somebody's uh Shield, flying shield. So, defend. Research. Oh, she can do research because of the laboratory. Your magic is nothing special. Oh, we got earth magic. So, let's do a search in this area real quick. Search, search, search. And while you're sitting there, do you want a shaman? You're sacred. Nature and astral. Sixty-five. Actually, hold off on you for now. Just get some some troops in here to help defend. Maybe if it becomes a problem. Bird magic. 
Yes, bird magic. What would bird magic be? I don't know. Next turn. Searched. Oh, nothing. Battle afflictions were cured, so Veronica doing her job. Oh, we meant that's Veronica wasn't here, so that was just cute. I don't know if Veronica is there. Summon breadcrumbs. How would you want to do that? better morale. They might like to be led by a shaman, maybe. Okay, reinforcements. I've got 45 of these guys now. Yeah, we're doing on research. Construction 2. 15 RP left. I'll pick that up. So. Hmm. Now we got a new person. Who's going to help with our research? Strength of Giants. Increase Strength. Oh, it doesn't have the skill because that's two. Why is it there, though? No protection spells, really. So, Lucas does have a javelin. So we should have him move up with the rest of the troops. Question is, what kind of magic is he casting? It's getting better, right? No, not really. Do advancing cast spells. This to be a little bit closer. Hopefully, be more effective. And then Veronica. No real offensive magic here yet. Shot spells. What other spells can you cast? And venom arrows. There we go. So our slingers are doing true shot and poison it. Poison balls of or sling ammo. So pebbles. 
poisonous pebbles. Any invisible care killer summoning spells? No, not yet. Not yet. Oh, and I think I've determined we're going to wait until next level before we move the army out again. So we can, might be able to get some magic items next turn. Or two turns away, technically. So might as well put you guys all on research. That'll give us a little boost. 124 that way. Hey, uh, Skybird, welcome back. Happy Wednesday. So again, this will get us uh, construction too. Oh, we needed construction three. Oof. Okay, maybe we won't sit here. So 40. Oh, cavalry. Let's go take out and see what they can do to them. I'm sure it'll be fine. Yes, the pun master is here. Uh, let's save up our money because we have to be able to build a temple there. We still have to build a laboratory here. Do we need that? I didn't see what we could recruit here, did I? Oh yeah, barbarians. Don't care about that. We can recruit here. Barbarians. Bow. No, no, sorry. These are deer tribe. Inept researcher. <laughs> so no research for you. Who's doing nothing? Oh, here. Hi. Assassinate enemy commander. Assassin tries to assassinate a random enemy commander. Only the assassin, the target, and his bodyguard will fight. Assassinations are performed before movement. Let's see what happens. We haven't actually tried any assassinations yet. So, in my previous playthroughs, this is a this is a new trick. Hopefully, fingers crossed. There's construction that gets us to two. Try. Blah. The attempt occurred while Gosu was outside, far away from prying ears. And did not work. So apparently our assassins should be better equipped. Oh. Forgot to change the the stuff. So did she die? Oh, and this is our main force. So we lost uh, one of those, three of those got three? How many lose three of them? Oh, because cavalry. That's the title end up looks like Rise of the Pancreas. No, it does not. Rise of the Pancreas. <laughs> Where are you getting Rise of the Pancreas out of the title? Thank <laughs> you. 
horses are running away. A little bit of friendly fire there. Just a little. Looks like oh, there's almost a heal. and arrows coming in though. Gary Anklis, welcome to the stream. Oh, poor horsey. Charge them like fifty dollars yes, charge them fifty dollars an hour. Oh, no problem. Okay, so that so re so uh, Vuko's actually got a kill. Battle affliction was cured. Yay! A new famous hero. Great deeds. So, what did you do? He was extremely. Is of extraordinary size and will have more hit points and strength at the cost of some encumbrance. Okay. So, unequaled obesity. Some more hit points. That's what you want in your sorceresses. Yeah, so. Let's construct a temple, search magic sites, and squash the unrest. And so what can we recruit here now? We get cavalry if we want it. Do we want cavalry is the question. It's not bad for flanking purposes. So I probably should. Sure. Except the resources in this province kind of suck. So we will not do that right now. Researching. Can't really afford to do anything else at the moment. Got the Sea of Woe, but it's just a big lake. Shh. Maybe it's a big... Underground, maybe there's a bigger underground lake underneath it. You know, it's possible. Eh, we can't do any good stuff yet. It's a mystery to be unlocked. Yes, unlocked. Sixty RP per month. So three months. Construction three. Yeah, that'll work. Next year. Searched and found nothing. Battle afflictions were cured. That's where Veronica's hanging out, because that's what she does. 
and stuff. Okay, so 90, not 60. Seventy and one twenty. So let you guys go back. I'll help out with research and that kind of fun stuff. Build up forces a little bit. I have a shaman here. Here. Lead your own people. Sure, it doesn't really do much, does it? Oh, we can make these guys faster, though. Do we want to give them, make them faster? I'm going to go with no. So, you just cast spells. They don't have very good morale, though. Should be fine. What kind of magic do you have? Search. Did you do it? I can't remember if he did a search or not. Yes, he did. I learned about Tyrannog from uh, Dark Age of Colin at Camelot, the realm. Yeah, Hibernia. Yep. Basically what these guys are. Palisades will hold off on that. Defend research. We need another researcher up here. So, beans. 13. Yeah, I'll get the beans. Still want another one of these, though. Potential assassin. Did you learn about the mystic knights of the Tirna Nog? Who? What? was a kid's show. Never heard of it. Kid's show. Mid-90s, that's why I didn't hear it. I was rather coming back. Okay. So patrol, patrol, and research, research. Next turn. Ah, yeah, Starlit Pond. I think we did that, huh? Starlit Pond gets us one astral per pearl to per turn. So go back to research. Or go to research. Have I tried being younger? Now, sadly, I do not possess any potions of youth or fountain of youth type stuff or a time machine. So, no. Defending the town. These guys are back here. Slingers. Ah, new person. So a specific spell. So, nothing really there. 
So casting spells. Let's keep you ever younger. Weren't, I, weren't you younger earlier in your life? I was younger 10 minutes ago. And I'll be older in another 10 minutes. It's funny how that works. I have tried being younger. It just didn't work. I wasn't trying to hide it from anyone. Instruction on three and next turn. So, Gimpy and Friends. Research. How much money do we have? 545. Supply is 1100. Supply usage is negative 21. We're very efficient with our... Uh, with our uh, food usage. Research and researching, okay. More researching? Yeah, more researching. Can't are expensive, though. We should stick to druids. I mean, nine, so it's only a four point difference. Oh, I still need to recruit a assassin. Oh, that's right there. Um, Yeah, let's do the druid. They're not expensive, so. Spirit was younger five minutes ago. It didn't last. That's, I think I said that. I said that already. I think. I try putting more time into it. I try to. Mace Man, welcome back. What place did you end up going, and which Titan is Veronica? I've been thinking of your own Torba, but it wasn't sure what build to go with. Uh, as far as bless, how do you look up the bless? This, how do you how do you find which ones you pick? Because I can't remember exactly which ones I took. <laughs> how do you find those out? <laughs> and as far as what Titan it is, she is the healer. The healing spring. She's that one. She's a healer. So that's why that's primarily why we went with her because she can heal stuff. And she also gets the start site, uh, whatever this one was. Because it was between her and the spear guy, and because she's the healer and got this, he didn't. He didn't. He's not a healer and doesn't get this. So that's why we went with her. Go to pretenders of the world. You can select your own bless. I know that. Pretenders of the. World. Oh, is this where you get it? Okay. Dumb. 
Scales and buses, luck limit stuff. Am I clicking on the wrong thing? Left click, right click, don't see. Click on no. They're under plus. Oh. Far right column. Oh, duh. I can read. So we got morale plus one, defense skill plus one, hit points plus one, force survival, and heroism, which gives them a plus 35% to experience. Thank you for pointing that out, though, because I was trying. I was looking for that earlier, and I couldn't find out where you, you go for that. But now we know. Research, research, and construction three. Okay, so. I'm trying to get construction three, so we can make some actual magic items, sort of, kind of. Oh, that was quick. Two uh, research is done. So we're going up to Thaumaturgy 3, then Conjuration 3. Uh, alter oh, we haven't done Alteration yet. I thought we did Alteration. Cat Eyes, Personal Poison, Personal Bark Skin. Enlarge. Oh, Mirror Image and Blur. These soldiers become blurred, transparent, and, diff transparent and difficult to strike in melee. Your image. So affects the caster. So small bless. That was where I was thinking I couldn't def decide on that with decent fight or good scales. Bless and never see pretender. Also, you can see any player's bless. Uh, there once you see it in combat arena helps a lot with that. Oh, uh, we haven't, I haven't been to the arena at all. I haven't even thought about it. We can animate trees. Blur. So if their attack skill reduced by two, tankers with true sight and spirit sight ignore the blurred condition and as do blind uh, blind ones, whatever. Alteration? Evocation. A vine arrow. Elf shot. Spell mimics the abilities used by sprites to strike humans down with without harming them. Target is struck unconscious unless the magic is resisted. Dance of ephemer ephemeral swords. Cloud of dreamless slumber. So she won't. She doesn't have air magic. So swords are only illusions, but they will attack, harass, and harm enemies unless they perceive the illusions for what they are. I don't know, I'm going to let those run for a little bit. Judas is the one because I could summon a neat. Oh, pets. Pets are overrated. And Affliction of Cure. This is Veronica doing her thing as a healer. So, new guy, Lug. Lug. Is it Lug? I don't know what called Lug. What kind of magic items can you make? Oh, look at all the weapons. Blade of Grass. <laughs> there is actually a blade of grass. Large as any sword and enchanted by the magic of the dream world. Wild. It is as sharp as any blade crafted by man, and those cut by its edge will start to bleed profusely. 
So draw blood. Got the thunder whip, seen that before. Hunter's knife, thorn spear. Toy sword. Shillelagh. So, you get luck and a retinue of one sprite. You get a piece of blood. Well, it doesn't do a lot of damage, but it's not horrible. It's a basic weapon, so. Two handed weapons. Gloves of the Gladiator, Thorn Staff, Staff of Flame Focus, and a Holy Scourge. Bows, Bola, Trusa Longbow, Just Man's Cross. <laughs> Arrows fired from this bow will find their intended target regardless of distance. You attack a sheep, does it bleat profusely? Hope not. Did Vukros go to bed yet? Mirror armor. Yeah, it has a large polished metal plate on its chest that is enchanted to protect the wearer against hostile magic. So hit points four, plus four, magic resistance three. It's not bad. Boots. Ranger's boots, birch boots, chi boots. So all this stuff. So a burning pearl. Ever burning fire that flickers in the dark. The pearl will grant partial protection from fire and increase attack skill to anyone holding it. So attack skill plus four, fire resistance five, assassin's patience minus one. So not good for an assassin. Fire in a jar. Temporary fire gems one. Cold resistance five, effects mount two. So if you're doing the fire thing. Ring of warning. Fine. Ring of levitation. Owl quill. Search plus six. So what do you need? Air. So okay. like air. I have aiming. And have missile protection. Amulet breathing. Handful of acorns. Produce three vine men that will aid the owner in battle. Bark skin animate. So you get bark skin. Somewhat susceptible to fire. Cat charm. Defense skill 4. Beauty plus 1. Nor's cauldron of broth. So supply bonus 150. So when you're making all those nice long journeys. Not the, no the skill is too level. Too low to make that though. Pendant of luck. Amulet of clarity. Marvelous feast. Is this a real feast though? As long as the tablecloth remains on the table, plates and cameras are free filled, but the feast is conjured from the dream wild and is not real. Soldiers partaking in the feast uh, might feel content, but they will starve as no real nutrition has been provided. What's the point of that item then? Gossamer cloth. Dreams and hopes it is said that the Tuatha wear cloth made from gossamer and they blah blah blah. He was aware to cover his fellows in glamour and shadows, preventing them from being detected by enemy scouts. Up to 25 units are hey, back made up. invisible. It is time to take a break. Although the enchantment does Go not stretch function your legs. when weapons are drawn. Your next break is in one hour. It keeps morale up? <sighs> yeah, but they'll starve to death. Enchanted saddle or enchanted barding? Hit points plus four. Saddle, hit points plus two, and a proud steed. Defense, morale, and magic resistance. Hmm. Horsey, defense, morale. I think we should get that for the horsey. For who cools his horse. 
Just make an enchanted horse. Well, we do have an enchanted horse. It's a fey horse. And this will make him even better. Give him a few more hit points. Make him more magic resistance. So, and better morale too. Welcome back with your tea. We're making a, sa a magic saddle for your horse. Question is, what should we make for you? Oh, you can't make all the cool stuff yet. You can. Uh, Ron can make. Is the Fey horse like a shame horse? Sure. I'm supposed to be taking a break, aren't I? Or it should be soon. Good saddle helps with charging. You're not really charging, though. And give you a blade of grass to fight with. I'm sure that'll go well. An eye shield. You know, when it hits the eye, she'll be punished by the ventral spirit locked inside the eye. The shield, the spirit will strike at the eyes of the perpetrator. I don't even know what gear Google's currently has. Oh, he's got the golden shield, which is pretty good. Got the golden lance. What was I making? Oh, making the barding. You should go for better armor, apparently. Because bronze isn't going to cut it. Berserker pelt, no. Shambler skin armor, no. Dire wolf, ranger's cloak, gossamer gown. Hit points, attack skill, defense skill, cold resistance. That's not bad. Or rather, the nation that will become man. No. Ranger's Cloak. Hit points. Stealth boost. You're not going to be doing stealth. This. Hit points and awe. Hmm. You want to be more beautiful with less hit points? Or more hit points, better attack skill, more defense, cold resistance. I think we'll go that route for Vukulus. she make she boots so I'm still amazing I like despite their iron soles the shoes will allow the wearer to deliver powerful kicks in addition to his normal attacks doesn't look like it's doing anything. Cold resistance 10. Mountain survival and winter move. Hmm. You saw a titan? Where'd you see a titan? I don't see a titan. I went titan. No, I did not go titan of thunder. I went uh, healing stuff. Healing whatever her name is. No, it can do the cauldron or broth. It's always nice to have. Although supply does not seem to be a problem for us. Luck. Ah, our little assassin. Can she make anything good for herself? Silent boots. Work out. Silent boots. Good Greek giants become scarce. Did they have tighten? Did they have to tighten? Did they have to tighten their belts? Yes. Yes, they did. Oh, that Titan. Titania Veronica is their name. She is uh, the. Matrona of the Healing Spring. She is a healer. A big, tall healer with dogs. A 
Okay, let me take a break. I gotta get up, stretch my legs, get some water, go check on Rocket. I'll be back in a few minutes. Thank you all very much for watching. Enjoy the dog video.